through it. That limitation called being timid is no longer there. I encourage that. You're gonna go through it. That limitation called being timid is no longer there. I encourage that. Hey, look at that smile, that's good. And so you're gonna make sure you set yourself up. I want you set up. Okay, so you got Ethan here. You're gonna explode through, right? You're gonna get low, get up on it, get up even more. Right here. Yeah, so your knee is, is center with the board. And you're gonna go through to the blanket, okay? Through the board. straight you're still short of the board right. it's got to be down through here right yeah yeah because yeah. yeah. you're just you're coming to the board and there's no power once you get there so you got to go down through squat down get a power position all the way through I want to tell you guys that your boards were double the thickness of Tony Robbins. What? Bunch of champions here! Huh? Uh, mind Let's over go. matter! Mind over matter! In your head, you're dead! In your head, you're dead! Look at these guys! Wow! Wow! Look at this! We'll clap, we'll center ourselves, you hear the music, and when it's time, you step forward and resolve. It's a done deal. Not only is it a done deal, it's already done. Thank you. to create, most people want to destroy. To create joy, to create love, to create opportunity for people around you, for yourself. What does it mean to be a leader? And she said to me, well, I really want to do this, but you don't know all the odds are against me. I said, every great leader I know of any age, of any time, loves it when the odds are against them. It's a huge shift. 
while you've done your part and I've done my part, there's something else that's played a role. It's called grace, or the universe, or God, or love, whatever you want to call it. We all have had grace, haven't we? You've done your part, but we drive on streets we didn't cave. We read books we didn't write. We use the internet we didn't create. We have grace in our lives, even have guidance. So right now, maybe close your eyes and give thanks to whatever you believe has guided you in this life. Three things in your life you're grateful for that you feel blessed by. People, or moments, grace. That's it, John. That's it, Patricia. That's it, Derek. That's it, Eric. That's it, Brandon. It's that brought us here today. It brought us together. It's freed you, allowed you to free yourself from all those bullshit stories that used to limit you. One more time, make the sound of all over your body. Go! busy to remember that she matters and that she's beautiful and that she's worthy. And I just had this moment where I'm like, if she's going to turn on her television and bless me with a few seconds of her precious time, I would rather have her look up and see me showing real women who look like her and calling them beautiful and meeting it. And, 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 and even if she bought nothing, I think that if you have a dream on your heart or an idea or a goal or a passion, it's part of your purpose. It's part of your calling on this lifetime. Did you go through a divorce and now it's your turn? Have you been playing small for too long? In a career that's not serving your heart? You just haven't felt all in alignment in so long. You forgot what it's like to smile. You forgot what it's like to just be joyful. Not happy in moments, but joyful. So the first thing that I want you to understand is there's something that we call the law of exposure. Someone drop exposure in the chat. The law of exposure. And what the law of exposure states is that the moment I'm exposed to information that can change the quality of my life, the moment I'm exposed to a greater, greater way of living, a greater way of healing, a greater way of energy, vitality, the moment I'm exposed, I can never be unexposed. I can never see life the same. Two, one, go! And you start to do away, you start to, your, your mind doesn't want all that other stuff. All the sugary drinks and all that stuff, it gets rid of it. Make sense? Yeah. back in your screens. I have missed you guys. I am joining you for our very final housekeeping before we go into the grand finale closing ceremony of Unleash the Power Within. 